Hey guys, it's Lambo Rock Strikes Back once again. I hope you like the Wireboard Watch Wee Poo Blood and Honey. And now I'm on to the next Wireboard Watch. So like I said, welcome back welcome back to my Wireboard Watch series. This is this is a series that I won't watch a movie, TV show, or maybe a specials, depends if I can find any, which I don't know yet. But anyway, and now I'm gonna do the Why Won't Watch the Cruise Family Tree. So let's get Let's get started. So now I'm gonna do a recap of what I think of the first two films. The first film was very, was very a very enjoyable, very entertaining movie. And now I'm now yeah, when I first saw the trailer, I was not impressed by it. I said myself it looks like a generic kids movie. I thought the trailer was a kind of cringy. I said myself this looks so cringe worthy. I want to see I'm I'm just gonna say I'm just gonna see Iron Man 3 instead, which that was I was more interested in Iron Man 3 instead of Cruise and I watched on Sky Cinema, Sky Movies, and it was in 2014, and it was a great film overall. Sorry in the background, I was outside for a bit, and saw noise, some noise in the background, so thank you on that. Back to the same, guys. And it was going to be something growing. Now, The Crew to a New Age, the sequel, the long awaited sequel to, to the, the first film. Yeah, I think, I'm actually the minority, but I, I'm the minority, but I think the sequel was a lot better than the first film. It was a lot funnier in the first film, it, the, the story was a bit better in the first film. I think it was. Anyway, now, yes, it's not my favourite Dreamworks sequel. It's not as good as Coffee Panda 2, which is a fantastic sequel, by the way. It was actually a great follow-up overall. And what I, did, what I just noticed, the director of the A New Age is not from the director of the first film. Because apparently, I think the reason why the director didn't come out to direct the sequel because he was, he was too busy making VO. I think that one of the Netflix that came in 2021. I think that's the re biggest reason why. Or maybe he was too busy making... Um, Ruby Gilman, Teenage Kraken, which here's the thing: I've never seen teen, Ruby Gilman, Teenage Kraken, but it's been confirmed. I'm gonna wait till it comes out on DVD or watch it online because it's not really my kind of DreamWorks movie that I would watch in cinemas. And the thing is, Ruby Gilman, Teenage Kraken got pulled out in cinemas in Cineworld, the one I normally go to. If you see my cinema vlogs, got pulled out in cinemas in Cineworld because due to the fact the movie was the biggest DreamWorks bomb, so. It's Rise of the Guardians box response all over again. It's, it's, that's right. So back to the topic. So, and, and I think it's a great single overall. And if you guys remember, I had to go through uh, three, lock, three delays of Cruise New Rage due to lockdown free bullshit. Yeah, remember that, guys? Lockdown free bullshit, I said in my videos. Yeah, you might know. So, here's the reasons why I, I don't want to watch this. I don't want to watch this show. Number one. I don't have Hulu in my area. That's the one thing. I don't have Hulu in my area. Hulu is an American streaming service brand, and I do not have Hulu in the UK. Not in Wales, not in Scotland, not, not in Ireland, not in my country as well. So we don't have Hulu in my country. So that's the biggest reason why I, I, I won't, won't be doing a rant today, because I have, don't have Hulu in my area. This fight is on Watch Cards Online. Number two, it has different cast. Seriously, it, it just why? It has a different cast compared to the first two films. Ryan Reynolds then came back to, to apply for his role as Guy, which I think he was too busy doing Deadpool Three or too busy doing Free Guy at the time. Something around that. That's the reason why he didn't play for his role. Emma Stone didn't come back to play Eep. Even um, Nicolas Cage didn't come back to play um, Eep's father. And Sandy, the actress, didn't come back. Even Dawn didn't come back. The actress played Dawn didn't come back. And all those stuff. They didn't come back to, to apply for their roles as the characters. And the grandma didn't come out to apply for her roles, which may rest in peace to the actress who played the grandma. Unfortunately, the actress who played the grandma in both Cruise movies sadly passed away. I don't know what things do to cancer or something. Let me know in the comments what the actress who played the grandma died of. And due to that, I don't think there will be a Cruise 3 due to the fact the actress who played the grandma died. It, that, I'll, I'll, I'll explain a bit later in the, in the video. Mama 3, the animation. Look at this. Look at this. So, hey, yes, what the hell is this? Uh, what? It's. Um, um, did you name it? What? Did you name it? Uh, yeah, it's the animation for the crudes. 
Bowling is about to, is going over the fucking overboard. This is the this is the worst looking animation I've ever seen since um I I don't know I forgot the show is I I I, I just don't know it's just this is the worst looking animation of the Hulu but look at the animation it looks like a show that you find in a HMV bargain bin. You basically walk, despite this OTD release, but I'm just doing it as a joke, guys. It's basically you walk to a local HMV looking for, looking, browsing through, looking through the HMV bargain bin to look for a TV show for your son and your little daughter to enjoy. So, and then you're like, oh, look, I found the crew to the range. They both loved the first two films. Let's get this, boo. Let's get this show. Good idea. Fuck this shit. Just fuck it. Another, another reason why is the acting. My goodness, they didn't really go do voice on the act, the, the characters. And now let's get let's get to the trailer, which I didn't do trailer reaction to it because uh, the reason why I didn't have who I don't have who in my country. But I'm gonna show you anyway. Just just saying, guys. How many points for hitting a berry? Ten points. And if you hit Graham, it's a hundred. Bonds away. Nobody cares. <laughs> Is that all you got? Damn it, hit harder by rain! Shot, That's Grandma. One. You've met the crudes. They've been called prehistoric. Oh my. I'm so hungry, I could eat a pig gator. Get up! Do you see and how hideous the animation is? Oh my god. Even evolved. the animation of the Benedict looks the absolutely terrifying. But what the hell they've done to it? Uh, don't touch it. Now they're sharing one big house. <laughs> and facing the future together. I taught Sandy how to eat with a fork. Actually, she's using Weapon. This is the good stuff. Get ready for an all-new animated series. It's on. Based on the hit movie, The Crudes at New Age. I gotta say, I know this term's getting awesome. This is about to be the cheapest and laziest animation I've ever seen for a DreamWorks show. And look at the design for Dawn. It looks ugly as fuck. Even the animation in Big Mouth has a better animation compared to this animation. Starts here. Steady the mind like this. I'm not to say the animation for Dawn looks like a ripoff. Taken, it looks like taken from the animation from Big Mouth. What the fuck? Just empty your mind and think of your happy place. Friendship is like a flower. It's beautiful, but it needs time to grow. Empty your mind. <laughs> the Crude's family tree. When you know caves as well as I do, they're not dangerous at all. Ah! See? <laughs> Save as it <laughs> gets. <laughs> and it's on Peacock as well. Yeah, you can see how terrible the animation is looking. So, and those are the reasons why I will not watch this show. So, do me a favor, guys. Just stick to the first film. And even stick to Crew to New Age. Which, those two are much better and well worth the time. And, yeah, I did rewatch both films last year with my, with my family. And not just that, guys. If you guys remember, The Crew to New Age was the very first movie I ever saw in Odeon. So, if you guys remember that. So, and, yeah, the way for that film to come to my area was a, was a bleep of fucking nightmare. But the way for Bob's Burgersby was even far... But the way for the Bob's Burgersby was even more far worse. So, yeah, and judging for the ending on, the, on New Age... I don't think there will be a Croods 3, so unless I heard, because due to the fact the actress played the grandma died, I don't think there will be a Croods 3, so they did kind of wrap this, so those reason why, just stick to the first two films, or if you are, you're in the UK, just go to your local HMV and pick up the two movie pack, it's worth your time to watch this shit, so thank you guys for watching, subscribe to the channel, like and share your friends, and I'm not sure if if I got, I'm doing a blurry with you this month, this this week because I've had, I I got work tomorrow and Saturday and Sunday, so I might just watch random episodes and do a review in it because I I, I want to review blurry for quite some time so now. Ever since I watch more episodes at Spain, so we'll see how it goes, guys. Until next time, goodbye. Oh.